Good morning, Bankslime Jewelers again here in Lancaster. I'd like to introduce today three ladies watchers and try and sort of give you a variation on why there's a difference in cost and a comparison between each. We're often asked for sports watches which are not only elegant and can be used for dress wear but something which are rugged and reliable and um, what the sort of costs may be if they need repairing in the future, new batteries, replacing, etc. So I've selected three from our stocks that we have here. We have an Amiga, which is this model. We have a Tag Heuer. And we also have a Breitling. Now, they are all different in their own way when you look at the design of these particular watches. They all have quartz movements, so they're operated on a battery, which is very accurate. And we find that a lot of uh, ladies, what they do like about the quartz watch, is that if they take it off and they don't wear it for a week or two weeks, whatever, the watch is still running perfectly. If there's any indication of the battery failing and needing replacing, they have end-of-life battery indicators which means that the second hand jumps invariably four seconds so it's not something that you've done it simply means that the battery needs changing now if we look at the relevant sizes because a lot of these watches for ladies they are available in one or two different size cases the Amiga which has this rather nice striped tech dial in all steel this is 30 millimeters sapphire glass steel case quite nice you can see that ticking away the case is quite nicely matte finished this is waterproof to 150 meters and it has a butterfly fastener which you need to press twice to open. In order to shorten the watch, you'll see here we have large link and also a half link, which enables us to get it accurate on your wrist. So nicely produced, this is one of their new case and bracelets. The crown itself is very easy to operate. You can unscrew it pull it out, you will alter the fingers and then in the mid position there is a quick date change Now, when you do pull this watch out both obviously the fingers move together on some of the gents watches it's only the hour hand that moves but uh, with this particular one everything will move together you'll push it back in and screw it back down uh, as I say, so that is a hundred and 50 meters matte finish bracelet it has a matte finish case but the actual bezel and the shoulders are polished retailing at 1750 it comes with a two year guarantee now so that is the Amiga watch we then look at the Aqua Racer by Tag Heuer it's all steel again, except it has a rotatable bezel, which goes one way only. The original idea of these bezels was for if you were diving, but um, I think a lot of people today are using them to see they have an hour on the car park. Just set the little luminous dot to the minute hand and uh, simply count off a, an hour, that's very helpful. Uh, the case itself is all polished. The clasp is a simple pushover fastener and releases by the two pushers. If you just press one the clasp doesn't come off, you've got to press two. So that's the safety device that they've built into it. It can also be extended like so if you were skiing and you wanted to wear it for skiing, it will, it will go over a suit. Or if you were scuba diving, you could literally open it and it would go over the wetsuit. The fine adjustment 
is here. So again, we can take out links, and then you have got the fine adjustment. The links construction of this particular one are pin and tube. So you have to physically push this pin out, and there's a tiny tube inside which grips the pin. So price-wise, £1,195, that particular model. And again, a two-year guarantee. So that's your tag hoyer. Moving on to the Breitling, this is the new Breitling Colt uh, quartz watch that they produced. I'm showing it here in the ivory dial, which is very clear. It's a 33mm case. Again, it has the time elapsed bezel, which goes one way only. Very clear. You also have the screwing crown. So we unscrew that and pull it right out, the watch will stop and then we can alter it accordingly. And with this particular one you've also got a quick date change mechanism which is the, as you can see that changing. So that's the Breitling. Again you've got a polished case, a little bit more shape to, to this particular dial, the way they've designed it. Uh, sapphire crystal again two-year warranty if we can turn it over you have a screw down case back the bracelet itself the links are screwing links and you do have another adjustment a finer adjustment on the clasp as you have with the Tag Heuer now the added security that you have with the Breitling is that once you've got this quite nice fold over fastener you then have a safety catch as well which displays the Brightly logo price wise 2220 now what I think it does it shows you the variation of watches that are available a sports watch an everyday watch with different features uh, the depth of water I mean they're all waterproof watches but this particular one is 500 meters so it goes down quite deep uh, the aqua racer is actually 300 meters where the Amiga is 150 um, I don't think anybody will have a problem with that issue quite frankly uh, you know they also keep out not only dust and water but it means that it's a very good everyday watch that you can wear comfortably and enjoy. Now, I had a look at what sort of costings it would be for replacing the battery, which obviously comes into question at times. Now, each of the manufacturers will charge anywhere between £90 and £100 for replacing the battery and re-waterproof testing it. Now, one of the main features and one of the main issues that we're sometimes asked about is it seems expensive for a battery. I mean we do a lot of our own batteries in-house if people were, were not uh, diving or you know wanting to go swimming with them. Uh, it is something that I think you should have. You should have it resealed because it obviously keeps out dust as well which can affect the mechanism. Now each of these watches if they go back to uh, the respective companies, whether it be the Amiga, the Tag Heuer or the Breitling, they not only replace the glass seal, the case seal and also the button seal to make absolutely sure that it's waterproof. So it's not like going into a normal shop and just putting a battery in it. They do change all the seals and then they will re-guarantee them for a further two years. So. I think it shows you the variety of uh, watches that are available for ladies, particularly on the sports watches. Uh, we do offer interest-free credit and we do have a, a very good range of all these particular models, both online and in the shop. So if we can help you at all, please contact us. Thank you.